Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are diving into the world of HomeNap dashboards, comparing four of the most popular options. Homer, Heimdall, Homepage and Dashi. I'll be running all of these dashboards in Docker. But keep in mind, they are also available on Truness apps, so you've got flexibility regardless of your setup. To make things even more interesting, I've configured each one with their PyHole integration. So we'll get a first-hand look at how they handle the same data in different ways. Before we jump into the comparison, here's a quick overview of each dashboard. Homer, a lightweight, highly customizable dashboard focused on simplicity. Heimdall, a polished application-centric dashboard designed for easy app shortcuts. Homepage, a dashboard with powerful widgets for server stats and external integrations. Dashi, a highly flexible and visually dynamic dashboard with endless customization options. Each of these dashboards shines in its own way. So let's break it down and find out which one suits your home lab setup the best. Let's start with Homer. Homer is all about simplicity. It uses a YAML-based configuration file to quickly add links, icons, and custom colors. It's lightweight and perfect for those who prefer a no-frills approach. It's super fast, minimalistic, and easy to set up. For settings and customization, it uses YAML files, but it doesn't have a lot of integrations. While it lacks advanced features, its lightweight nature makes it ideal for low resource environments or if you're just starting out. Next is Heimdall. Heimdall is an app launcher at its core. It doesn't just provide shortcuts to your apps. It also supports enhanced apps like PyHole, where it fetches real-time data without needing complex configuration. It automatically sets icons for most apps, saving time during setup. Configuration is done through the web interface, no YAML or coding required, but some users might prefer file-based configuration over web UI. If you prefer a polished app-centric dashboard with minimal setup, Heimdall might be the perfect fit for you. Now let's talk about homepage. This dashboard is perfect for power users who want more than just a launcher. With its JavaScript-based configuration, homepage allows for powerful widgets, from server stats to weather and, of course, detailed PyHole metrics. We have a wide range of integrations available and it supports Markdown for a clean and readable layout. But it can be complex for beginners and has a slightly heavier impact on system resources. If you're comfortable tinkering with code and want a dashboard packed with features, homepage is the great choice. And finally, Dashi. Dashi is the most feature-packed of the bunch, with a drag-and-drop interface for customizations and advanced widgets for nearly anything you can imagine. It's a visual powerhouse. You have a stunning visuals with custom themes and animations, but it requires more system resources and the initial setup can be overwhelming. If you're looking for a dashboard that truly stands out visually and functionally, Dashi is your best bet. To sum it all up, here's a quick comparison table highlighting the key differences. So which dashboard should you choose? If you're just getting started, Homer or Heimdall are great options for their simplicity. Power users who love widgets and customization, Homepage or Dashi are clear winners. And if you're using Pyol, all of these dashboards integrate beautifully. It just depends on how much data you want to see and how you prefer it displayed. Personally, I run Homer on my Kubernetes cluster because it's lightweight and does exactly what I need without any overhead. But let me know which dashboard is your favorite in the comments below. Thanks for watching. If you found this guide helpful, please don't forget to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon for more home lab content. And I'll see you in the next video.